Hello students. In today's lecture, we are going to study about the classification of class mammal. In our last lecture, we have already studied the general characteristics of class mammalia. Okay. So now we will, we are going to look up for the classification of class mammalia. Mammals include about 5,000 living species, and there has been several fossils that are forms. Okay, then and uh, this uh, the class Mammalia are classified on the basis of first, that is one is the mode of caring for their young one. Okay, then second uh, characteristic feature on which the classification has carried out is the dentition. Okay. Third is the foot posture and fourth is the exoskeleton that is the presence of nails, claws or hoof. Okay. Fifth is the complexity of the brain and sixth is the systematics. Okay. So these are the six criteria on which the classification of class have made, class mammalia have carried out. Once again we will revise that the first mode is the First criteria is the mode of caring, uh, the caring that have taken uh, by their parents uh, for their young ones. Okay. Second is the dentition. Third is the foot pose posture. Fourth is the exoskeleton. Then fifth is the complexity of the brain, and sixth is the systematics. Okay. So uh, the uh, the class order contain eighteen living atra one eta okay eighteen living orders of mammals which are first divided into two subclasses that is class subclass one prototheria and subclass two theria okay that is uh, and uh, the further classification um, and for the more detailed study of the classification of class mammal you can refer uh, a paper published by G. Uh, G. Simplon S. I. N. P. L. O. N. In that you will get a complete review of the complete review of the uh, classification and the principles of classification of class mammalia. Okay, and it is published in a 1945 volume 85. Okay, uh, and he had recognized total 18 living and 14 extinct orders of the class mammalia. Okay, so subclass one prototheria are referred to as the primitive egg laying mammals and class prototheria subclass prototheria is further classified into order one that is the monotremata okay whereas the class uh, subclass two theria is classified into uh, sub, uh, is classified into two infra class that is metatheria and eutheria okay so in today's lecture we are going to see what are the characteristics of the subclass prototheria then prototheria classification that is the uh, subclass prototheria classified into order one monotremata then we are going to see about the uh, subclass theria Subclass theria classified into infra class 1 metatheria uh, that will be metatherians will be con will have a pouched animals mammals have a uh, pouch in which um, the young ones are nourished and uh, infra class 2 eutheria that are the true placental mammals okay in uh, in today's lecture we are just going to see the infra class 1 metatheria and the classification that is in uh, the metatheria is further classified into order 1 okay only one order that is marsupialia 
सो क्लास वन प्रोटो थेरिया आर द प्रोटो मीन्स फर्स्ट थेरिया मीन्स बेस्ड ओके सो दे आर द फर्स्ट बेस्ड लाइक मैम ओके एंड दे विल बी हैविंग नो पीना ऑन द इयर पीना मीन्स द पीना इज द ओनली विजिबल पार्ट ऑफ द इयर विद द स्पेशल हेलिकल शेप ओके एंड द फंक्शन ऑफ पीना इज टू एक्ट एज अ काइंड ऑफ द फर्नल विच असिस्ट इन डायरेक्टिंग द साउंड फॉर द इन टू द इयर सो दिस पीना इज एबसेंट ओके एक्सटर्नल पीना इज एक्सेप्ट इन द प्रोटोथेरिया इन द स्कल अ टिम्पेनिक बुला and the lacrimals are absent whereas the jugal is reduced or it in some form it is totally absent okay then the teeth are present only in a young one whereas the adult it has been uh, modified into a horny beak okay the pectoral girdle possesses large uh, coracoid bone okay and it will be also having a interclavicle एवर एज द पेल्विक गर्डल विल पॉसिस एपी एपी प्यूबिक बोन विच विल बी एक्सटेंडिंग फ्रॉम द पेल्विस एंड द वर्टिब्रे इज विदाउट अ टर्मिनल एपिफाइस एंड द रिप्स हैव ओनली अ सिंगल हेड वेर एज द टर्पेक्यूलम इज एबसेंट एंड द सर्वाइकल रिप्स आर प्रेजेंट ओके दिस इज अबाउट द एक्जोस्कैलिटन वेर एज द अक्लॉयका इज प्रेजेंट into which uterus uh, and the urinogenital sinus get open okay mammary glands are without the nipples and there is no corpus callosum in the brain uh, they will be having a, a like a cochlea is a simple process that will be uh, in the form of seculus and the not uh, without the coiling uh, testes are abdominally placed Uh, female are oviparous and they are mostly uh, the uh, members of this prototheria are found in australia new guinea and tasmania okay and uh, this uh, subclass include four orders out of which only one mo- mono monotremata is the leaning group others are extinct so we'll see about the order one monotremata mono means single trima trima means opening so they have, will be having a sing, single opening the general characters of uh, they will be showing a general characters uh, which will be similar to that of the this uh, uh, prototheria okay and example of this organ uh, member um, monotremata is the uh, platypus Okay. Platypus is uh, the body of the um, organism uh, is covered by a soft hair, and uh, it is um, and hair on the dorsal side may be coarse or spine-like. Okay, they will be having a web digits. Uh, then pina is absent external uh, but uh, uh, in this the monotremata the pina is distinct but it is very small uh, they will be having a poisonous pur which is present in the male and brain wax corpus callosum uh, tail uh, may be present or absent in some forms the dental formula is incisor i can i p uh, i means incisor c means can i p means premolar and m means molar okay uh, uh, 0 by 5 means 0 uh, is um, or uh, just uh, consider x by y x will be the upper half and y will be the lower part lower bit okay that's how it is okay uh, then the body temperature varies between the 25 to 28 degrees celsius uh, they will be it is said to be monotremata so said to be a um, linking between the reptiles and mammals 
okay so they will be having the pectoral girdle that will be resembles like a reptiles they are the egg laying okay uh, the eggs are large and undergo myroblastic cleavage tongue is long and sticky and in this what happened the teeth basically uh, is for in a uh, is modified into the big form okay the example is platypus another example is ichidina that is uh, spiny end eater okay then next uh, sub class 2 that is theria theria means animal thera means animal so they include modern viviparous marsupial and the placental mammals okay uh, both uh, viviparous marsupial and placental mammals are included in the theria then the, they will be having a ear which is usually external uh, will be having an external pinna memory gland with the nipples or teats will be present teeth are usually present in both in young one also and in adult one also okay and whereas the vertebrae will be having a terminal epiphysis okay cloaca is usually absent and testis is usually in a scrotal sac okay uh, vasa differentia bladder will open through a common urethra which is termed as a penis and the ureters uh, open into the base of the bladder okay oviduct open into the vagina and subclass theria is further divided into two living infra classes that is infra class metatheria okay and second one is infra class 2 is eutheria in today's lecture we are just going to see the meta class um, infra class metatheria and the classification okay meta means between or after so this are the marsupium or the uh, organism which are included it will be having a brood pouch that will be present in the female okay memory glands will bear a nipples uh, and epipubic that is marsupial bones are usually present and it will be attached with the pubis and uh, that separate um, caracoid and the interclavicles are absent corpus callosum that is present in the brain uh, part of the brain is uh, like uh, like it is rudimentary uh, or in some form it will be absent vagina and the uterus are double here because it is termed as a di uh, delphic condition means vagina and uterus are double and placenta is rudimentary uh, yolk sac type okay hence they have a marsupium it is said to be a uh, so uh, the function of placenta is not there okay. they are confined to the australian regions only the members of infra class 1 metatheria are confined to the australian regions only all the species which are living found in australia okay. um, this um, metatheria is further classified into order 1 that is marsupilia okay marsupians means Beyond means pouch. Okay, the young one are born immature. Uh, the most of the characters which are seen as we saw of the marsupial is similar to that of the metatheria. So I will just uh, tell you about the marsupial pouch. That is the in marsupial pouch. What happened? The young ones are born. When the young ones are born, it is immature and it develops in the marsupium attached with the nipples and teats okay so um, the young one will feed inside uh, they, they remain in a pouch and they feed on a um, memory gland and memory gland is provided with the nipples or teats in this then the dentition in this marsupilia the dentition is three molar, mol, molar and four molar are usually present you can see 3 by 3 P and M that is a molar 4 by 4 okay, molar is present and other characters are similar to that of the metatheria. The common example known example is kangaroo.
if you have any question regarding this topic or today's lecture then please message me in the group okay thank you